What's going on, everybody? No, maybe we, you should get. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today we have a Q and A. So we're gonna be answering some of your get or you guys's and gals questions. So without further further ado, uh, let's see what we got here. Do you plan on keeping it as long as you could? I'm guessing you're talking about plan on keeping Ruby. Um, yes, I plan on keeping it. That's my forever car, unless like by some tragic, you know, fortune, uh, unfortunate events. It gets totaled, but yeah, this is like, I learned so much with Ruby, and Ruby's actually one of my, not dream cards, but like a goal. It was like, I always wanted a boosted SI, and I got it, so it's staying forever. Um, whose car is that? that? That's actually her car. Yeah. What car? Uh, I'm guessing it's Ruby. Ruby? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's my car. It's her boat. It's, yeah. it's actually her car. Somebody asks, if you didn't have your car, what other car would you have gotten? What do you think I would have got? Um, probably an S2000. Um, I don't know, my first, really now, my first car, what I probably would have gotten. I think you probably would have gotten. Uh, I honestly don't know. Probably like an Acura TSX or something like that. So you yeah, would like have gotten over S2000? I think as my first, yeah. Because I have to have some four doors first. If I didn't have my 2006 Accord boosted up, I would have probably gotten an Acura if I could afford it. Yeah. But your girl broke, so. If you had to choose one, would I choose photography or cars? Which one would I choose? Um, that's a tough one. I think you choose cars. That's a tough one, that's a good one. Probably, I'm not sure, because photography, I can photograph cars. But with cars, you know, I can go fast. But you have to choose. I probably no, go I for think cars. If I you choose photography, go. it doesn't have to be with cars. I, I go, yeah, I go with cars, with cars for sure. Hardest part of marriage is another question. Hardest part of marriage? I think hardest the hardest part of marriage is like maybe getting used to like the little things that your significant other does. Um, you know, you're so used to doing stuff your way, but yeah, I guess so. Yeah. You know, when it comes like to both of you guys doing your own thing your own way, then you kind of like, you realize that you don't like certain things. Yeah. Um, like, you know, it just, it's just an example, like maybe you like the toilet paper set up a different way or, you know, something crazy, like you like your clothes folded a certain, certain way. Or like like putting up your like boots and stuff like that. Yeah, I think that's like, uh, not the hardest part, I, definitely not the hardest part, but it's something to... I think like getting along, like not getting along, but learning to live together as a couple. Being married, it's completely different yeah. from dating. And you know, making sure that you take care of the other person's needs as far as emotionally and definitely food, like physically. Yeah, yeah. food is very important. <laughs> Like, if you don't have food, like food? forget about your wife, because Yo. she's going to go out the Yo, door. Yeah, honestly, food trumps emotional. Like, yeah. if, the, if your significant other is, like, having a poopy day, food. You don't even have to say I love you. Just yeah. get a Chick-fil-A. <laughs> food, bro. That's crazy. Um, all right, another question. Uh, favorite song right now? Favorite song right now for me? I like I Want It by Yellow Claw. I want it, yeah. Like, but it's pretty good. Uh, favorite song for me right now? Okay, yeah, I think my favorite song right now um, is probably Rewind by um, Yellow Claw. It's uh, crazy melodies and, you know, the trap drops, which is like, drops. Yeah, I think that's my favorite right now, but that always changes every week or something like that, so. Uh, dream Car. Acura MDX 2017. That's my goals right now. Yeah, with like a three inch drop, right? So no. it's like... I like bigger cars. Like I like SUVs. I like trucks. Such a mom. Uh, I think my dream car would probably be a S2000 for sure. Like I am... I like S2000 I love too. the S2000. For some reason though, they're so small. So it doesn't make me feel secure. Like I need something like spacious and big. Yeah. Especially me, I'm a bad driver. They, AKA she wants a Honda Pilot as well. No, I do not want a Honda Pilot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think my favorite car is definitely, my dream car is definitely an S2000. I am definitely gonna get one. Sometime in the future, for sure. Absolutely. Um, 
How's your first year of marriage with the pandemic been? Awesome. It's been pretty good, honestly. Honestly, the first year of marriage, a pandemic aside, most people say the first year of marriage is the toughest one, but for, I felt like for, for me, it wasn't as bad as people make it seem like, oh yeah, it's the toughest year or whatever, but it was- Your wife's here to be. It was, um- Choose your words. It was you. way, it was like, I don't know how to explain it. Definitely not tough. Yeah, it was- But it was more good. more of a, like a learning experience. I, I felt like year one was like a learning experience, and now after year one, we finally actually get to, you know, like to- the real stuff. Yeah, like the real, we get to the real stuff, which is... Yeah, honestly, to me, it wasn't bad. Yeah, so... So, Junior's pretty patient, so that makes things run a little smoothly. So, what music do you listen to when you drive? On your way to work or on your way to, like, I don't know, whatever? So, on the way to work, I listen to pumped up music, and on the way back to work, I listen to depressed emo music. Shouldn't it be the opposite? Like <laughs> on your way to work, you're depressed. Because it's the hardest day ever, shit, that you went through. No, I think I always listen to pop music. Yeah. So like anything Yellow Claw or like Jamaican music. She said Jamaican. <laughs> <laughs> like isn't that a guy Jamaican? The guy that looks the St. John dude? No, he's not Jamaican. Oh, he's not? No. Oh. Well, I listen to him. He's pretty good. But he do got them from Brady vibes. Uh, I think I think I listen to a lot a lot of Slushy for sure. Like his dream yeah, so his dream cool. album. All all three of them just really Slushy's cool. like chill though. Yeah, I love Slushy. Slushy's dope. Um So what am I upgrading to? I'm guessing you're talking about like camera wise. Um camera wise, I do wanna like the next camera I'm definitely getting is the 90D. I, I was gonna jump up to like the R5, but you know the way my bank account is set up, you know, I'm kind of so the 90D is the most probable slash realistic camera upgrade that I'm getting. Um, so ADD will go for sale when it's time. Favorite Netflix show right now? Um, so I just finished watching Queen's Gambit um, and it was pretty good. That's, there was one I was seeing that it was a, it's about this blind girl and her best friend dies. Oh, yeah. But I forgot the name of that one. That one's good too. Um, I think I don't know. I don't really have a like when I was ne watching Netflix. Like I, I watch it with my wife, but like the best shows I've seen on Netflix is definitely the Daredevil. Oh, that show is amazing. Daredevil was really good. Uh, I'm still watching Arrow and Flash. Uh, yeah. um, but as far like a Netflix exclusive show, definitely Daredevil. Uh, what else is on there that's pretty good? On Netflix, um, Gossip Girl. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Daredevil, <laughs> sure. Uh, plans for 2021? Um, definitely save money, work on, so right now I'm trying to work out and get to the best shape, I guess, that would make me feel good. Um, I want to gain some weight and gain some muscle. Gain. So, overall just growth, human, like spiritually, Emotionally, physically, just positive vibes everywhere. Yeah, for sure. Um, plans for 2021, I think. Uh, I agree with everything she said. So, what, 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 what she said? <laughs> positive growth. Oh, yeah, getting, yeah, get, not being broke no more. Oh, um, yeah. Definitely yeah. money administration, better money administration, because yeah. we love to shop. You need to quit that. Speak for yourself. We both love Speak to shop. Speak for yourself. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, you know, stop. It's money growth, basically. Just overall. Get out of poverty is the word. Yeah. Get out of poverty. Um, uh, definitely want to upgrade some turbo stuff on Ruby. Get the hatch running. Oh yeah, paint the actually, hatch. Actually, like swap the hatch. Just upgrade the hatch. And the 2021, maybe visit Cali? I do want to go to Cali, maybe. if COVID. Yeah. Permits. And um, I think that's it. When is Ruby getting a fender exit? Um, I don't know what that is. Sure. Maybe. Stay tuned. <laughs>
Uh, a quick drag race, but we switch cars. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that sounds good. I mean, you probably be, you probably stall it, so I still beat you. Alrighty, and that's about it. Yeah. So, oh. I don't know how to end this. And scene. So Sorry. that wraps up all the questions. Uh, if you guys want me to answer any more questions, just follow my Instagram, ask questions, or just leave them in the comments. Follow mine too, JSB Suarez. And we'll make some more uh, Q and A questions. This was actually pretty fun. Yeah. So. All right. But next time, more questions for me, please. Yes, more questions for the man. Well, for both. both. So uh, on that note, have a good day. Peace. See you later. <laughs>